Good morning. Good morning to you all. Welcome. I'm Daily Fix. Sorry for the noise from my chair. I'm still waiting for new parts, so the noises just don't just drop in anymore. Uh, currently live here on Twitch. Um, we got Evan Testa. Hello, mate. We were a bit busy. Yeah, man, I got BDD123123 has, has absolutely gifted me <laughs> 15 subscribers yesterday and, 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 and 2,000. 580 bits which in in so um all of the subscribers actually got a second emoticon which does include my face so um you can have fun with that there's a bit of a story with him but uh yeah <sighs> hey pdd speak of the devil there you are mate how are you doing how was um, Thanksgiving for you there in, in, in dear old Canada? Well, we, um, we're going to be talking about what this stream is going to be about. For you guys later watching this on YouTube. <laughs> Yo, those are it. Uh, watching this later on YouTube. Uh, I want to get going at least trying to overlook all of the planets to see what we want with them what we want to do with them and not only the first icon because you i, I gave them icons i i did like I, I wanted to specialize them in some sort of a direction and then you can see like there is a naval academy here on a planet that is spiritualist uh, and to my knowledge we currently don't have any spiritualistic buildings which uh, is a bit of a shame. Of course, it does bring you... This is a specialization of a planet. Uh, so, th that is, of course, very cool. Eventually, we'll have more bu more buildings for it. So, yeah, that's, that's going to be what we want. We will try to roleplay a bit. Uh, I don't know this mod actually at all. This is the first time of me playing it. So, I'm very grateful to have people on YouTube as well here in Twitch who are guiding me through this process uh once again what i'm trying to stream for the next three hours for those of you on youtube that will be um at least six episodes because i will cut them up in 30 minutes <clears throat> i think i'm going to get a cold and that is very annoying <laughs> Um, so I'm, I'm glad to hear PDD that your thanks given was uh, was good. Okay, let's get started uh, before we actually do anything. So we decided that this is just going to be our capital. We can of course focus it on on research, which does include me removing the stronghold as well as the admin. I don't think that is a bad idea, but do we have any other planets that actually have... And I don't see any specialization in here just now. Yes, actually we do. Society and energy credits. So I did this. Let's go ahead and let us say... Let's put these brackets. Uh, energy research. Holy crap, BDD, 510 bits. Oh, dude, dude, you you, you are absolutely uh, amazing. 3,090 bits, that is insane, mate. Uh, okay, that's the first one. We'll, we'll, we'll look at these first before we do anything else. So we'll slowly go over all of the planets. Uh, of course, later on YouTube, if you want Dilithium Source, that is interesting. I think that is... Isn't there anything for... Yeah, Dilithium Mining World. There we go. Dilithium Mining World. We'll try to be as focused on these planets as possible. But we definitely need a Dilithium Mining on this. I will always look at this before deciding what buildings we need. Uh, where are we? We're with Sigma. We have building cost, which is... I don't know, man. I don't know. Draconis is having its population grow. We already had that. Um, this is definitely not a food planet. but And we're assisting research here. That doesn't seem like the best option. Um, looks like industry... It will have to be an industry world more than mining. So we'll just do... Well, we don't have to. We can always just change how this planet is behaving. 
Let's take a look. Where are you? Industry world. It gives you building speed as well as upkeep. And it's both on 10%. Now, if you focus on Forge, you will get 20% on that one thing. Uh, and and I, I don't think that's that good. Oh, man. So, um... Evan, how are you doing today, mate? How are you doing? Uh, Pajem was spiritualist, and we'll just see where it goes. We can, of course, create a shit ton of food from this. Uh, small towns will create some trade as enmity, so we have a bunch of that. Uh, the monastery will actually give us unity, as well as consumer goods, which is very interesting. We can make this into a... Consumer good production facility. I, I like the spiritual retreat though. I do like that. What do we have over here? Absolutely nothing. Well, definitely not mining then. So we can also... Well, we can make you a mixture. Of genera. It doesn't really matter what you do with this. To be honest, it, it's all about the buildings you place on them. Okay, that, that's all of them. Technology world. Uh, we have one job available. I really like this new idea. Yeah, man, I uh, <laughs> I do make a, I make the habit of making a fool of myself. Um, we we created the first one, which is the Hooked. Uh, which, uh, which got me hooked to any games. And the zombie is referring to me being exhausted. Uh, because usually I'm skipping the night when I stream. Um, one of my dogs is just not lying comfortable by the, <laughs> the hair of it. Um, so here we go with our warning, which we always do. <laughs> and that's... Yeah, you got those from the bits. Hi, man. Yeah, that's... Uh, I think you need like to spend a certain amount to get those emoticons that you're using right now. So yeah, uh, fair warning for you all, I have two dogs, they are running free here in the house. Usually they like to lie, <laughs> still, or lay still, or whatever. Um, except for one who is very particular about his position. <laughs> he needs to have a blanket in his mouth, he needs to have it tight, and that is how he sleeps. Something like that. And it is, um, it's a process for him. You'll have to give him time. You'll have to give him time. He will do his utmost best. So, okay. Well, we got those planets done. We still have a lot to do. We got some on... Ooh, spiritualistics. I bloody hate that. Ruler jobs. Admin and unemployed, huh? Some dogos were breeding today. There are dozens. Uh, very noisy dasuns. Well, at least one of them is. Oh, well, we, we, we've already discussed that. Um, we do want to make sure that our economy... We are still recovering, okay? Dear Lord, Jesus. Go lie down, dude. <laughs> Stop it. Yeah, finally, dude. Oh. Okay, let's take a look. What were we doing? I've been warned that I need a better fleet. Even though I did reduce my fleet, and I know people will hate it for it, we um, we also need to grow and um, some more allies. I'm lowering the volume of my voice so I can actually hold on faster. We have some unity to go. Uh, envoys are twenty percent more efficient. Uh, currently, we're using five out of five. Um, one is representing our interest in the Federation of Zions. Two, three are actually doing that. And we have two, improving our relationship with the Denoblian as well as the Dalton Union. I think that would be interesting. But the Embassies plus three unity is just amazing. And I, I want to take that right now. Diplomatic acceptance plus five. Envoy improve relationship by 1% is really Really cool. Chance each month to acquire, acquire a favor. Which is cool, man. Which is absolutely cool. And we have the direct diplomacy. Trust cap plus 50. Which is very strong if you want to, like, create some vessels. So, yeah. I overall... Yeah. Of course. I'm an idiot. Uh, I remember that I turned off all of the traditions. And, and then I started complaining about a bunch of it. Trust growth... 
let's build that up let's get this one going as well and the next one is going to be um eminent diplomats so yeah that, that will help me we have a bit of a task on our hands with our empire sprawl because that increased like crazy technology i don't want to hit i to be honest i wouldn't mind removing you and maybe make an admin planet out of this but if we have enmities we can easily create a bunch more jobs in the clerical department by increasing this we'll get one clerical job which uh, overall will give you two enmities which is never going to be enough uh, we have to if, if i'm going to do this if we are going to be committing we have to do it right. Four jobs over here. Meaning some of them aren't even filled. So this minor job is not being filled. I'm thinking that I want to demolish this one. And um, this way we'll get these jobs filled more easily. And when we have... Okay, bureaucratic world. So we're actually focusing on this planet already for bureaucrats. There is a bit of crime going on. We do need to get this going because that's a bit low and I want a bit a uh, bit more jobs. Let us get into... In what tab is that again? I believe this one. Let's increase that with another admin office. This mod is the only reason I want a PC. Can't you play it on, on, a, uh, an, on a laptop, mate? Because I, I can run it on, on, my, on my laptop and it's not that good. Uh... Let's take a look. What else do we need? This is a mining planet. Two jobs. I don't want to mess with that. Okay, we don't have jobs over here. And we are going to get rid of this admin office. It will hurt me a tiny bit, but we might want to focus this on, on research. What would be a good thing to focus on main plan? I'm, I'm, I'm sure we'll get like a lot of these uh, very specialized buildings. Uh, like the headquarters for the Federation and stuff like that, uh, which might be or might not be a actual buildable thing. Two jobs over here. No jobs. Generating uh, energy. We can make this into a secondary bureaucratic. But I'd rather do that with things that don't focus on energy because this will just create a good amount of output what kind of um, computer do you currently own uh, pdd luxurious residence manufacturing we can make this into unity that would not be a bad idea you oh your chrome no 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 you're right it won't be uh, possible for that. Ah, we need a planetary administration for that. This one doesn't have jobs, nor does it have houses. This will create two houses and two jobs. So let's get started on that. Uh, which will push up my consumer goods. No jobs. Dilithium. To be honest, I, I think it would be the best if we immediately built this dilithium thing on it because i tend to run extremely low low on this uh, dilithium industrial world we could make some more consumer goods over there let's make a civilian industries we have, we have a precinct house i don't know if i like that because if we upgrade this we actually gain um a job which involves this security officer so if we change you say i kind of feel we need to have not this we have more than enough mining for now can i not build bureaucrats over here lacking minerals okay so we'll have to hold on let's uh let's finally on pause and see i'm on the phone right now wow I, wow, that, that, that's some commitment. So, um, w at what time yesterday did you um, pass out? We have a hostile fleet present and we have a scientist dying, which is very unfortunate. 
Oh, that would be good. Just just make sure you got like, which is very normal, like an SSD and, and enough RAM to play it. Uh, the graphics card. Graphic wise, this game is not that bad. It's just very heavy on your on your um, on your on your core. It's the CPU. Okay, that's that's quite a fleet in there. I don't like that. Is there anything here? Construction ship. Cannot build this type of station around any of the planets in the system. So I think it's already queued up. Yeah, that's what's happening. We need something to get the trade going over there. And we are going to be definitely turning this system into a no-fly area. You are currently over here towards Vega. I think I want you to go... And I cannot... I would like to start going towards the Zindi. I need a scientist in this angle, actually. He's going to go back. I might want to take a few more scientists and just make sure they're all on automatic surveying. And just focus. Uh, um, 2 a.m. That's your 10 a.m. Oh, wow. That's almost the end of the stream. Well, man, that you actually hold on. That's very, very... Nice. We have a plague, which we do need to deal with. How long do we actually have on that? 703 days. I think this is a perfect time to start cranking out a, uh, a few more scientists. And then... Let's do three for now. And uh, we do want to... The, the reason why we're so low currently is we just don't have... The jobs filled. So we'll have to wait until the jobs are filled to actually see what the economy is doing. While we build up on influence. Oh damn, his ship is lost. Yeah, I, I knew he was probably not going to be able to get out of that situation in time. Let us close off these systems for now. They're not the strongest, but for... My guys, they are horrible. Let's close you off as well. Until we have that big ass fleet. I, I've been warned. I've been warned to definitely focus a lot more on my fleet power. So don't worry. We'll actually get into that. Uh, you know, that is fine. This is a problem for sure. And that could be a problem for sure. Okay, let's close these off. So, man, you hold out long. There, you definitely hold out long. Uh, these need to be stopped. And this black hole also has no... I love there are so many NPCs around. That's so good. Also, uh, the developer was uh, from this mod was actually uh, commenting on one of my videos, which is great. You know, I could really use that um, just to give me some, uh, some feedback on, on, on what way I should probably go. Okay, we, I think we... Are we getting done with these? Okay, 71. We have the research center, which is nice. There's, there's so much research in here. I love that. Deflectors for better shielding. We have structural integrity fields. Um, main structural integrity field generator for star bases. Could be interesting. I love these um, phaser turret Mark IIs, though. It, it It's immediately... You can, you can just find that back in your ship's uh, firepower, which is always good. The Yorktown ship class cruiser, we're actually... Uh, it, 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 we're researching that, so that's nice. Uh, in Star Trek, do you think there's space hippies? Oh, yes, there are. <laughs> you will have hippies everywhere. There is no no denying that. Okay, you, you're a doctor. You go there. Uh, then we have this scientist. Do we have someone free? Oof. Okay, that's that's not good. What do we have over here? Research speed, temporal mechanics plus 15. FTL, damage, evasion, and stoplight speed. These are good. These are very good to have on automatic surveying. Can I ask you... Surveying that. And then... I also need you to survey that. And then you can do whatever you want, mate. 
then you can do whatever. Uh, the final ship is being built. This star base still has a slot open. Unfortunately, nothing to fill it with. The Orpheus Mining Colony, the transportation of a large amount of materials and personnel to Luna in order to repair the damaged dr drone on the Orpheus Mining Colony is complete. And the mobile drilling platform is operational once more. We gain one max district into a mining. Uh, actually, no, we gain one max district, one max mining district, and one max generator. So we, we can build a additional district overall. Now, there's a bunch more. I think we can go as soon as we have it, like weather control. But this is Earth. This is Earth. The Armstrong City will just give that as well. We can upgrade our research. But it looks like... We need to wait until we get the planetary capital because crime is definitely going up. Protecting the spaceman, peace and love. Set the, I think this is definitely space hippie stuff. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to be changing you into a precinct. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking we're going to be committing towards an admin office. This, this is... Horrible. Horrible. Campaign cost is 160%. Rare resource edict, 116%. We got tradition adaptation, plus almost 70, and technology plus 50, which is extremely expensive. So, yeah, we got a bunch of things to do. Currently, I'm not building jobs here, because we're still trying to fill all of our planets out, because that's also very important. You still got two jobs, you're building, you got one job, agriculture, which is okay, is for now. We can, I don't want to focus too much on my empire sprawl. Why did I make you a food planet, actually? It would be better suited as a mining planet, it doesn't really matter, we have 10 go, this is a... Uh, Six, seven, and this is would make ten in total. So we can just keep building these, which is fine. We'll do that for now uh, and not change that. Generate a world, no jobs remaining. Definitely, we need to get some stuff going. We have 10,000 Latinum. That's great. I love those numbers a lot more than with Star Trek New Horizons. Um, a thousand left them. Come on, man. What the f what the hell is that? We also have technology encountered. The Romulan Star Empire using the disruptor weapons. Our scientists believe we may be able to develop this technology ourselves. Okay. Planted on nutrition. Anything in here that I want to go with? We have already have one, so it will be costing me. Diplomatic grants. It, fe it feels very Federation-like like that let's take a look here with the science council priorities energy our active focus is on phaser weapons and i don't want to change that i don't want to change that we, we could go with disruptors but you can see right over here like it's very weak on shields and i uh, that's not good. This has two pluses. Plasma weapons, but I think they're very slow. Tetrion. Oh, what a name. Now, we'll keep it on plasma, and hopefully we'll gain the torpedoes soonish. You can prevent the bot load of them, but I don't want to. Share designs. Don't. Not able to do that. Component priority. Modifying shield priority. Oh. They are both enabled. Polarizing the hull and deflector shields. Yeah, I like it. Economic and skill priority. Depolarize... Deprioritize economy of skill research. 
No. No. Uh, we will adjust our economy to fit our research. Let's end the transmission. I don't want to change anything there. This timed project. Where is that? It's still there. He, he, that, we, we did send someone, right? We did send someone. Yeah, I'm sure of it. Uh, can we... How expensive that? That's 150. We can build two of them. Uh, we have to wait until our scientist is ready with that. And then we'll just uh, focus on what is else. Kick from the Alliance. Leave the Alliance. We... As soon as we focus... Can we... Can we get something going over here? Let's see. The Packlet Nations. I bloody hate the Packlets. I really don't like them as a species. Sorry. It's true. Recall Embassy. Some people were complaining that they don't like the scale of the ships in this mod pack. I love the scale of the ships in this mod pack. It's way more realistic than having a ship that is just as large as a planet. Uh, that leader died. We know that. Let's unpause. Okay, what else can we do here? Uh, we're actually just shy on the minerals for now. So what we'll do is we'll wait until we have a good amount. Also, when we fix our energy crisis, then we can focus primarily on fixing all of our planets to uh, suit our needs. And first up, of course, is looking at what kind of specialization a planet has and getting out of this empire sprawl nightmare. Civilian industries, that will help me with my consumer goods. And we can easily offset this. Let us get our envoys improving relations with a 1% chance to gain a favor. Which is extremely strong. Let's take a look at this. We have an ascension perk. and I, 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 There might be new ones. We have peace in our time. Available envoy and envoy improve relations plus 25%. Also enable the mutual respect relation. And that is interesting for like when you're playing the Federation. World shape, I've never taken that. Uh, enigmatic engineering, never taken that. Fleet maneuvers could be useful. But it used to give you, I believe, a buttload of naval cap. And it's not doing that anymore. Defenders of the galaxy, diplomatic weight plus 20%. And... Everyone's up here. Ev everyone's. Like, not only the, the ones you like. No, everyone is better. Interstellar Dominion, Virgins. Okay, Master Builders. You can take this already? Technology Ascension. That might be the one that we'll go for. It's, it's kind of like a no-brainer. The Final Frontier. Anomaly Discovery Chance. You need to have the Exploration. Oh, well, we gain a Exploration Cruiser. Ooh. Commercial ventures. I like that some of these are tied with traditions. I really like that. Post warp alternatives, singularity manipulation, free enterprise. No, we're not going to be raiding. Not as the Federation, it just feels so wrong. Well, I think it's going to be technological ascension, and then we'll see in, in a few months what we'll take next. We're still, like I said, we're stabilizing our economy, as well as trying to grow our borders as far as possible, before we'll have to be uh, focusing on everyone else. The timed project is on the go. He is actually over there. You are still moving, and I think... This scientist is now ready. Mm. Sure, let's take that. And I want you to... Yeah, there's a risk, of course, that they don't go to systems anywhere near. It's a risk I'm willing to take. Uh... At some point, we'll just be expanding. Nevertheless, rivalry, the Dell Union, the Zindi Council. So, these guys are not going to be... He looks badass. Dell Union, revoking association status. No, I kind of want to give you 
a full-fledged membership, but the Denobulians are a bit annoying. Crime continues to be a problem on Earth, and the um, extensive criminal underworld has now taken root on the planet. Some areas have the same... Okay, well, it's annoying, but we're already building a precinct. Can we do anything else here? Not really. Special project. 